What's shaking everybody? This guy's back at you. And today is Friday, September 25th. And we're going to do a TTM video today. I usually review my TTMs on Monday from the prior week. I'm a little bit behind, so I'm going to do two weeks worth of TTMs. So it's uh, 14 uh, pieces of mail to review. So let's just get on it. Uh, the first one I have here is from Santa Ana, California. Three of three of ten days. And this is from... Mr. Charlie Huff, sorry about the light. Mr. Charlie Huff signed the 90 upper deck for me. I think this is 84 tops, nope, 83 tops. And 92 upper deck. Yeah, so thank you Mr. Huff. We'll showcase this one. Put it right there. Oh, nice glare, that's good, all right. The next one is from Cedar Rapids, Iowa, two of two in 10 days. And this one is from New England Patriots tight end, Marv Cook. He signed this, uh, looks like a short print upper deck, 93. And he got the game day for me, 92 game day. So I'm collecting this set. And this card is going to go to my Patriots fan. A big, uh, well, one of my friends is a big Patriots fan, so I'm just going to forward this to him. He'll be really excited when he sees it. So, anyways, thank you, Mr. Marv Cook. We're going to put you right channel. Okay, the next one is from Austin, Texas, 404 in 19 days. And this one is coming in from Mr. Kelly Gruber. He got two of these uh, big tops cards for me. They're slightly bigger than the normal card, but not as big as the game day ones. So he got two of these for me and an upper deck 90 for the set and 89 upper deck. So thank you, Mr. Gruber. We'll showcase this one right here. Right here. There we go. The next one is, again, from North Texas, two of two in 14 days. And this one is coming in from Mr. Mari Buford. Mr. Mari Buford, a former kicker for the Chicago Bears, signed this 92 stadium club for me. And the 92 game day. That game day looks really, really nice. So, thank you, Mr. Buford. We'll put you right here. Ready? Maybe. <laughs> Come on now, Maury. You stay right there. The next one is coming out of Albany, New York. 4 4, 22 days. <clears throat> Excuse me. And this one is from Mr. Derek Brown. Mr. Derek Brown got this collector's choice card for me. This is a 1994 collector's choice. He also got Stadium Club, looks like 93 Stadium Club. And then the Action Pack card, that's a little bit raised over here. You kind of feel it raised a little bit. These Action Pack cards are pretty cool. And he signed it right there nicely in back. Black looks good. This is a 92 Action Pack. And of course, for the set, 92 game day, he got for me. So 404, Derek Brown. Thank you so much, Mr. Brown. We're going to put you right next to Maury. Right there. Okay. The next one is coming out of San Diego, California. Three of three in 14 days. This one. This one is from Billy Ray Smith, former Chargers linebacker. Got this Pacific card for me. Another one of these raised cards. This is um, high pro marking. I guess this is another action pack, similar type like action pack card, 1990. And he didn't sign it in the front. He signed it in the back. That's pretty cool. And then for the set, that game day card just looks spectacular. Look at that. That is awesome. Awesome, awesome. Thank you, Mr. Smith. I'm going to put you right here. Moving on, the next one is from Syracuse, New York, three of 
five, three or four in 16 days. And this one is from <clears throat> Mr. Tim Green. Tim Green assigned one of those raised action pack cards, 1990 it looks like. And of course for the set, NFL Game Day and also a Pro Set Platinum. And he also signed, I think he wrote a book. And let me get this open here for you. So he sent me information on his book about uh, Left Out. So if you want to check that out, you to pause the video, you can read up on that. Thank you, Mr. Green. And the next one is from Santa Ana, California. One of two in 13 days. And this is from former Met Kevin Elster. He signed this 89 upper deck for me, but he did not sign the 90 upper deck for me. I wish he would have done it in reverse. If he only signed one, I would have signed this one. But that's okay. That's all right. I'll just send it back out to him. Thank you, Mr. Elster, for signing this one for me. Put you back here. The next one is from Provo, Utah, for four and 11 days. And this is from Mr. Vance Law. Mr. Vance Law, it's hard to tell on this card, the Oakland A's card, but he has a really elegant autograph. It's a little bit more visible here. This is a 91 upper deck. This is a 90 upper deck. It looks really nice. This one has 89 upper deck. And it looks really nice here on the 89 Fleer. So thank you, Mr. Law. I love those old Oakland A's uniforms, the yellow. It's really cool. So here we go. We'll put you right here, Vance. And the last of my small envelopes is coming out of Cincinnati, Ohio. That's a five of five in 12 days. And this one is from Mr. David Fulcher. David Fulcher got this Pro Set card for me. It looks like a uh, 91 Pro Set. Another 91 Pro Set. That's his normal common card. And this is 80, 89 Pro Set. What I do like about his autograph, it takes up the whole card. And then specific card. And then this game day card. Looks spectacular. Love the, the game day cards. Alrighty, we're gonna put David back here. Okay, now we get to the bigger envelopes. This one is coming out of Boston, Massachusetts. One of zero, nine days. And this one, oh, I sent an email out to Mike Ruzioni, and he sent me a picture, autographed picture of him, in the USA jersey, part of the 1980 Olympic team. So. Thank you, Mr. Aruzioni. I'll put you right here. The next one I've got is coming out of uh, North Houston, Texas. One of three in 10 days. And this one is from Mr. Mark Thurman. He signed this nice four by six for me. I also included two cards that came back unsigned. Well, at least I got him back, so I can send him back out to him if I want him autographed. So, thank you, Mr. Thurman, for getting that for me. Put you right there. <clears throat> the next one is coming out of Syracuse, New York, for four and ten days. And this one is from Mr. Frank DePino. He has a nice autograph, too. I love the legible autographs. You can read almost every letter in his name there, Frank D. P. No. So, he signed this 4x6 for me. Put it back here. And he also signed 89 Fleer. 90 Upper Deck for the set. And 88 Don Russ. So, thank you, Mr. DePino. Put your cards back here. And to wrap it up... Got the last one coming out of Tampa, Florida. Three of three, eight days. And this one is from former New York Met, Roberto Hernandez. He signed this four by six for me. 
Looks really nice. I'm going to put you back here. And he also signed. Uh-oh. You stay up there. He also signed a couple of cards for me. This is um, a Topps 96. And then this one, this next one is a 95 Upper Deck Collector's Choice. So that wraps it up for me. These are my last two weeks of TTMs. And if you notice, you only hear one voice this week. Uh, Z and this kid have gone back to live with, with, uh, with their mother. So I won't see them again for, you know, a few months when they come back next summer. So anyways, um, I've got to wrap this up. i got to pick a My Guy of the Week. And I'm looking around. i got some USA Olympic hockey. i got baseball. i got a lot of game day football. <clears throat> uh, and I've always said... Hall of Famers get bonus My Guy of the Week points. And I'm looking around. I don't see any Hall of Famers. Do I? I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure on this one. But anyways, My Guy of the Week, Mr. Gold Medal winning Mike Eruzioni is My Guy of the Week. So thanks for watching, everybody. Like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Tell your friends this guy is out.